guys, today I'm doing a ColourPop Cosmetics haul. Um, these are all the things that I got from their Black Friday sale. Now, as you guys all may know, ColourPop Cosmetics have pretty affordable price points to begin with. And then on top of that, it was Black Friday, so it was really, really good deal. And I got a bunch of eyeshadows because I'm an eyeshadow girl. And then I was very, very interested to try their lippies, their like uh, liquid lipsticks. So I got some of that and I must say that all the products that I got, I was very, very impressed with the quality, with the pigmentation. I, I'm officially a fan of ColourPop Cosmetics. So now without further ado, let's get started. Alright, so the first six eyeshadows are from their Blitz collection. Everything is so beautiful, very like bling blingy and like mesmerizingly beautiful. Um, as you guys can see, all their eyeshadows are this like screw up and down faces, which I don't think is the most convenient way to approach your eyeshadows. Uh, but the packaging is simple and you know nice and the price point is really really good so I'm not going to complain. Uh, first eyeshadow is called Valley Girl. It's almost like a white pearly eyeshadow and it's a um, pearlized finish. Oh my gosh guys, see that? This is just one swipe and this is what you get. It's pretty dang amazing, impressive. It's like, it's stunning. I'm, I just cannot believe you get this kind of eyeshadow for like, how much is it like each? Five dollars? Six? Very, very good. Next up is Thirsty Girl. Everything from their Blitz collection is something girl, like Party Girl, Valley Girl, something girl. Uh, this one is Thirsty Girl, and it's a uh, metallic finish. So, oh, yes, this is everything, guys. This is, again, just one swipe. Can you guys believe that? It's almost like cream. But it's not cream, it's a uh, powder eyeshadow and it's just, oh, it's just amazing. It's just beyond words. Next up is Party Girl, love that name. And uh, um, it's a matte finish. So uh, looking, looking at the eyeshadow like this, it's going to be a great transitioning eyeshadow and yes, it's so pretty. It's kind of like that. Uh, really light dusty pink color so oh, it's so soft this one right here this is party girl what well, doesn't look like a party girl it looks like a very shy girl <laughs> to me uh, but that was that still very gorgeous and then I have a fan girl it's a pearlized finish and oh it's so, so amazing. Look at that. Oh, there goes the perfect eyeshadow for your girl's night out. It's amazing. See that? See that? It's like that bluish, navish color and it's like uh, pearlized. It's just beautiful. So that's that. And then this time it's that girl. Yes. <laughs> that girl and um, it's a uh, metallic finish oh my gosh see that right here it's like khaki eyeshadow with silver shimmers almost like glitters and this is just just beautiful it's gorgeous oh my gosh like ColourPop Cosmetics, you guys, what do you use in your eyeshadow? The pigmentation is just crazy insane. Alright, so the last eyeshadow from that uh, Blitz collection is Roller Girl. And it's a metallic finish. And I'm out of fingers. It's like black. Ooh, wow. That's a beautiful black. Um, it's got multiple, like... Uh, what, what are these? Hold on. It's got like multiple flecks of glitters, like really, really finely milled glitters. So, 
so amazing. Oh, this is so beautiful, guys. So there, six eyeshadows from their Blitz collection. All right, next is this eyeshadow, already drooling, right? Um, it's too shy, and it's a uh, pressed pigment. And, oh, I'm dying, you guys. See that? Oh, okay. Oh my gosh, I've never seen an eyeshadow like this in my entire life. This pigmentation, okay, so ColourPop Cosmetics eyeshadow pigmentation um, in summation is like Nicki Minaj meets Honey Boo Boo. It's outrageous and it's amazing. It's awesome. Oh my gosh, I don't believe this company. Oh my gosh, yes. So that was Too Shy. See, this one is Too Shy and this is Party Girl. This one should be Too Shy and this should be Party Girl. I don't know. Um, okay, so moving on to the next eyeshadow which is called Game Face. Already loving the name and it's a uh, ultra metallic finish. So that's a beautiful eyeshadow and Oh, it's so soft and it feels almost like a cream guys. It just glides on. It's crazy There that's the game face It's so stunning. It's like it's just out of this planet So that's game face and then I got another like bluish eyeshadow called coconut in pearlized finish and Yes. Do I need any words? No. I can feel it. I can feel it. Oh. Yes. So this is, what was it? Coconut. And this one was Shy Girl. So it's like really, you know, uh, more like oceanish, kind of more bright uh, blue. Whereas Coconut is like darker, deep sea kind of uh, blue. Both are crazy beautiful, as you can see. I'm dying, I'm just digging this company. All right, next is So Quiche. Is that how you say it? I don't know. And it's a metallic finish. Uh, very, very, um, kind of like natural, kind of neutral color, perfect for every day. And uh, oh, it's so soft as well. Yes, it's like, yeah, it's a very, very nice everyday color. Every day for me, not to, uh, not to everybody, I don't know. Uh, so it's a beautiful, like brownish, khakiish color. I think it's perfect for almost every day because, I mean, the color is not up on your face. It's pretty natural and neutral, so I love that. And then, oh my gosh, this is, this reminds me of Katy Perry, California, and all those like awesome things. <laughs> uh, and uh, it's a uh, it's an eyeshadow in fantasy in pressed pigment. That's not a finish. I don't know. So, <sighs> yes, so excited. Oh, it's so soft and creamy. You guys see that? That's one swipe. That's one swipe. Come on. Is it real? <gasps> this is crazy. So this is fantasy. It's so living up to its name, fantasy. It's, I'm loving it. So that was that. This as well is almost like, kind of like, uh, somewhere in between creamy and powdery. It's like on that borderline. It's kind of like creamy texture and then it's not that creamy because it's like a powder. Um, it's supposed to be a powder eyeshadow. I don't know. Just beautiful. And then the remaining three eyeshadows are all like champagne-y and like uh, creamy colors. So this is called Tassel and it's in metallic finish. So that's like snow white color, very beautiful, and it's almost like that creamy oh, texture. <gasps> Love it. It'd be perfect for inner corners. <gasps> yes, why is it so beautiful? Oh. 
I just want to keep all these eyeshadows in my pockets and just bring them with me everywhere I go. I mean, oh, so beautiful. All right, next is Fringe, and it's a metallic finish as well. This one is like off white. The um, tassel is just off white. And then this one is like champagneish color, kind of yellowish. And oh, I just, I'm, I'm just, I don't know what to say. Pretty much the same, but uh, the tassel is off white and uh, the fringe is kind of yellowish champagne color. Both are amazing. And lastly, this one is Liberty and it's a uh, ultra metallic. All right. And it's a silver color. Yeah. <gasps> What is this? Is this from the from the space? What is this from? Are you from another planet? Cause you are crazy. Oh my gosh, guys! I don't know if you can see, but this ultra metallic um, finished eyeshadow in Liberty is just crazy creamy, crazy soft. It's like almost like a foil finish, if you know what I mean. Ah. Oh. I'm, I'm, excuse me for making that animal noise, but I mean, I just cannot get over it. It's so beautiful. So those are all, all the eyeshadows. I mean, I cannot wait to use them on my face. I just, I wish I could just slap them all on my cheeks, on my lips, and just all around my face because they're so beautiful. And now I'm going to show you guys all the lippies. I got five of ultra matte and uh, one of lippy sticks so I'm going to start with this one this is just a regular lipstick um, in Tootsie you guys this is so cute it's like a little sharpie you know it's so cute I'm really digging uh, the packaging so the Kylie Jenner type of uh, brownish dark mauveish color and I have a feeling that I'm going to really really love this color all right oh yeah oh yeah I'm already loving it oh you know what it really reminds me of Velvet Teddy from Mac mmm loving it Ooh. So that's Tootsie from ColourPop Cosmetics. It's pretty moisturizing. I don't feel like my lips are dry. I mean, it's only been a couple of uh, seconds, but it feels really good. And I really love the color. It's totally in trend. Um, and especially for those who just, you know, uh, initially love that nudish kind of dark lipsticks, you'll absolutely love this color. So that was Tootsie. Uh, the rest of the five stuff are all these like uh, liquid lipstick type of things uh, which are very much in trend right now in the makeup world. So first, I'm going to try Trap. So this is Trap and oh my Trap, you got me trapped in your spell. It's such a beautiful Kylie Jenner color. It's crazy! And it dries so fast and um, I don't think it's that drying because uh, just because of the uh, nature of all liquid lipsticks, they're drying. In, you know, it's bound to happen. But this one is not like that drying, kind of drying, but not that drying. And uh, I think um, in the first application, it was very liquidy, and then immediately it just dries and uh, just end up being a really nice liquid lipstick. Oh my gosh, I'm so loving this color. This is crazy. Oh my gosh, Trap, where have you been? Ah, oh, I need you for the rest of my life. So this is Trap. And now we're going to try this color in... How do you say it? T-U-L-L-E. -L -L -E. So this one as well, 
feels fantabulous um, and it's a really nice sexy and dark bearish color I'm so loving it if I have an event where I have to really dress up then I would totally wear this one it's so like I don't know like it just makes me feel really like sexy and like really fun and excited I'm really loving it and also since this is this one is like darker and deeper color I feel like it makes your teeth wider than they actually are I don't know but I'm loving it next I have solo and it's a beautiful like baby pinkish color so this one is definitely more like a daily color I can see myself wearing this to any kind of makeup and uh, it's just you know that that lipstick, that lip gloss that, you know, popular girls wear. I don't know, just something about it just reminds me of those like popular girls in high school. It's not like, you know, um, theatrical, it's not too over the top. It's like everyday color, but it just makes you look so pretty. Um, so that was Solo. And next we have Shimmy. Oh, Shimmy is the true Barbie pink. Oh, this is truly the uh, the light pink, like baby pink kind of color. It's so so pretty. Like it can literally go with all types of eye makeup. Like all sorts of eye makeup, you can wear it with Shimmy. So. Oh, I'm loving this color. So if you're like me, you love like nudish color, you love like, you know, dead body kind of like um, crazy nude color, then you would definitely love this one. Uh, it's not nude color, it's definitely pink, but it's a very light and nudish pink. I mean, this is the kind of um, color that I love on my lips. I, I'm just... Whew. Last product is teeny tiny ooh ooh it's definitely something new and I'm loving it it's like beautiful vampy dark brickish fudgish color wow I love it like oh, I love it it may seem like it's very Halloween-ish, but I don't know. I I love, you know, everything makeup and I love pretty much all hues. So uh, that was teeny tiny and I absolutely love it. So I'm in love with these like ultra matte lips, but you do have to know that these are basically liquid lipsticks. Therefore, they're quite drying. So if you already have very dry lips, then make sure to smother your lips with trend transparent lip gloss or any kind of products that are very hydrating. Uh, the kind of issue that I have to deal with with my lips is that my lips are my lips have too much moisture. I don't know why. Maybe I have too much saliva. I don't know. Uh, but whatever uh, lip product I wear after a couple of hours, like on the very center of my lower lip, there's like a very weird, disgusting line. I don't know why. I don't know what it is. I don't know why it happens. But uh, with these like liquid lipsticks, I have absolutely no problem with that. So I'm like the biggest fan of liquid lipsticks. But if your lips are dry, once again, then definitely mix it with something else or try to go for like a more, you know, moisturizing lipsticks or lip glosses. So that was today's haul. Thank you guys so much for watching. I have more hauls and more videos coming up. So don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And also, if you want to have more fun with me, don't forget to follow me on my Instagram and Snapchat, which are all Makeup by Dami. You guys have a nice, wonderful day, and I'll see you very soon in my next video. Bye!